In this world, there are good wizards, bad wizards, and all in between. But nothing in this world is greater than the god Honk Saram, who watches over our world, giving us objectives, rules, and keeping the world in line. Don't anger the god or he will smite you. Welcome to Fairy Tale Origins. Hello everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more Fairy Tale Origins with me and on the May because I'm on my own. Do you mean, I don't know, he's been marked as away for like the last two days? I don't know, he's not normally marked as away, like he's, a lot of the time he's marked as do not disturb and stuff, you know, that's whatever, he still messages you on me, eventually answers. And normally he's like on Steam, but it says like he's busy or away or something on Steam, but like, you know, he's offline on Steam. That's really weird. It's almost like he's not on his computer. That's that that would be really weird for Demon because he's not consistently been off his computer for two days in quite a while. So yeah, I wonder what's happened to him. But yeah, back on Fairy Tale Origins, where um Yeah, so the thing with Mitch <laughs> Oh god, I caused the server some little bit of a little bit of trouble uh with my little uh chicken prank. Oh yeah, and fun fact, some people did go snitch. Uh well some people just put in the comments like chicken and stuff like that. But like that was whatever that didn't say always oh, been pranked and stuff and I, I think by that point he'd already probably seen the chickens then one dude just went gingy pranked you and your bat he stole your bat and hid it in your smith in the smelter well jokes on you you stupid sod because i moved the bat from the smelter because i was gonna leave it there was it although you did tell mitch which means you're a bastard uh which i even respond to the guy like what the fuck you're ruining the fun like it's literally ruining the fun why the hell would you tell mitch exactly where his bat's hidden god damn it takes half the fun out of it same as telling i'm the one that pranked him should let him figure it out for himself that's that's more interesting to be honest but never mind eh we've got snitches and that's their dicks they're bastards they just want to ruin the fun of the series and you know what? whatever they shall probably continue to do that because they are silly people and i have no respect for them but whatever it's fine we're we'll moving on but right um yeah i think with chicken so um i thought when you go on the redstone the repeater thing with like 12 rounds and i know those more efficient ones and crap and i was just doing it off memory i haven't played with redstone ages I've, been, I've done better before in the past but never mind um but yeah basically i thought for as long as someone's on or in that chunk the chicken thing will keep sprouting chickens and that'll be fine that way it'll be like a decent number of chickens and i know he's got the record target to just kill them all but he had bats and stuff i didn't think he would because it might kill his own animals or at least that was the thought process. Unless they forgot, in which case, haha, you just killed your own animals. You killed my land. You deserved it. But whatever. Um, oh yeah, plus the massive lag spike that would come from killing that many chickens. But yeah, so um, I stayed on. Bunch of chickens spawned. That was fine. Yeah, turns out the world... I don't know if it's all chunks or if it's just Mitch's chunk. Like he's got a chunk loader there. But something kept that chunk loaded in because it kept going for hours. Like, either someone went on and stayed on the server for hours, which seems mental because the the freaking uh amount of ram that would be required to stay on the server for hours would be unreal unless they, like logged off and logged back on but yeah uh basically by the time mitch came on he was swimming in chickens i don't think he recorded it because he probably couldn't because i came on like three hours after that and i went and checked there and yeah it was literally a tsunami of chickens it was beautiful i went down to one frame i could basically not move i actually ended up destroying like a, a block of the redstone just to stop the chickens because there was that many it was lovely. Yeah, Mitch has destroyed them all, though. I don't know what he did to get rid of them all, but they're all gone now. Hopefully he recorded something about it, or he just, like, he's recorded something of a reaction to it or something, but whatever. Well, I guess I'll have to watch his next video, just see if he does react to it all. If not, then let him continue on his merry way. But yeah, so, um, right, stuff I want to do today since that was it. Oh, I did, I did pick this up, though. I did pick this up. Yeah, someone's missing a, a dragon egg. I'm not going to hatch it, though. That'd be mean, because someone else got the dragon, and I just kind of borrowed it. Um, it was just lying there. I'm just like, you know what? I'm taking it. You can probably guess who it is. Uh, someone will be missing a dragon egg. They'll probably go on their video. Oh, my God. I'm missing a dragon egg. And I'll eventually say, openly, like, here, yeah, I've got this dragon egg that I found, <laughs> and see what the reaction is. I want to see people... I want to see if the person reacts to it first, though. Yeah, don't tell them. I know people will, but you shouldn't. Like, snitches get stitches. Don't bloody do it. God damn it. It does ruin the fun of the whole secrecy thing, because then the person just... It's not as funny a reaction to it. It's better when people don't know, and it's the figuring out part and the revealing part and stuff like that. Like, think of Naruto Season 1. Think how le less funny it would have been if I just showed everyone and people had snitched about, like, who was what. We had so many secret things going on. It was hilarious. Also, my dogs just ran in, because my dog does that when I record. 
for some reason. But yeah, think how less fun it would be if ever, if people were just snitching and revealing all the secrets. That would have been so crap compared to we had tons of secrets going on, me being one of the bigger ones, and yeah, big reveals at the end of it all was just brilliant, even for the fans, because the fans never knew until that point as well. But yeah, just to keep big secrets can lead to funnier content. Why the hell would you not want funnier content? You're watching a YouTube channel. What else are you here for? We're not gained videos. We're, we're here to entertain. So let us entertain, damn it. <laughs> Alright, that rant's out of the way. Well, for now. Uh, oh yeah, I found a roof on these guys, but because people were saying they need to have a roof. I don't know if this counts as a real thing for a roof, but I've seen them breed with that roof before. I've done it on several servers and they've bloody bread for me, but whatever, they're not doing it now, so whatever. Alright, big thing I want to do today, I want to play the silver spells, because I've not really done anything with them so far, and I really, really should, because they're really important, aren't they? Plus, um, the Tuberity, aka, like, the Discord chat for Fairy Tolerance, basically, the people were talking about doing, like, a tournament type thing, because we saw, I think, we saw the arena, didn't we? I think with Demon, we saw our fighting arena. And yeah, people were talking about doing like a kind of magical tournament. Obviously, there'll be rules in place, so it's not like broken as hell. So, AK, there'll probably be like no red guitars, or at least not in Slay Anything mode. There'll probably be no, um, which we call, there'll probably be no, uh, gem armor, because that would be stupidly OP as well. And stuff like that, will probably be no fly rings and stuff. There'll probably be no. I'm gonna say Star Strike just because of the amount of lag that can get caused from that spell, but I don't know. Like, it'll probably be made so that people actually have to try and battle it out and stuff, so... Yeah, Xylophone is probably gonna win it, because I've seen the number of hearts he can create. <laughs> um, people mentioned he's, like, near immortal. Yeah, yeah, he is. I, I, I saw, like, just a brief bit of what um, the magic he got up to. Because, you know, we're in the same team, that's fine. We're in the like, revealing stuff about the own teammates, that's a fine thing. Revealing stuff about the enemies, not so much. That gets boring. Alright, so I want to start playing the silver spells. I actually already made stuff to get all the silver spells. I've actually already, like, created the stuff to unlock them. So I've already got a uh, link on all the stuff. Fire Rain and Ice Rain. If you want to take a guess what they all are, that's Mana Link. All the stuff's buff power, because you literally need all the stuff. <laughs> like, you need all the power-ups. In the world. Um, you get like Swift Swim, Leaps, uh, Slow Fall, Gravity Well, which, yeah, doesn't seem to really be making me fall any slower, which is odd. Um, yeah, there's Haste as well, so it's just like all the things are on this spell, which is quite lovely. Then obviously Fire Rain and Ice Rain are, um, whatchamacallit, they're Blizzard and Firestorm. So that's the thing. So I've actually already unlocked them, which is good. I want to try and put them into a spell now, and there's one in particular I want to give a try to. Um, Mana Link. Now, people a while back went and said, oh, go double your magic and stuff, and I was not sure what the hell they were talking about. So, I went and did some looky about -y stuff. I actually, like, I didn't see this on anyone else's video, but I did notice on Richie's video that he had more magic than what he should have. I had no idea how he did it, so... Yeah, I never got the answers from the people, but I did, I was aware that it was possible. So I might have to look you up, and apparently, I don't know if this one is correct, but if you, I use Self and Mana Link together, um, I might be able to create a spell that literally doubles my mana and mana regeneration, because I don't know, I'm just drawing out my full potential. So, oh god, what do we call this? Magical Awakening? Sure, why not? Magical Awakening. Um... So, right, what do we need for you? We need essence for actual stuff. Mana battery, essence conduit, crystal wrench, and mana focus. That's such annoying things. <laughs> All right, what the hell's an essence conduit? Is that an essence maker? I actually don't know if that's what it's called. S essence conduit. It's apparently invisible. All right, so we need stone and shimmery. That's not too hard. All right. Um, I don't know why I thought to look in this chest. <laughs> it's very odd that I decided to look in this chest for something, but right, hold on. Let's grab ourselves some stone, and we'll get this spell together. So, one, two, three, four. If I have mana conduits, or essence conduits, invisible, what the hell? Yeah, there it is. <laughs> why is that invisible? That's so weird. Right, uh, we need a mana battery, and, uh... Mana Focus. And a Crystal Wrench. I'll need to make another one of those because I don't want to give up the one I've got already. So Crystal Wrench is the two flowers, Vidium Dust, and Iron. That's easy, easy. One, two, three. Uh, Vidium Dust. 
plus flowers. I didn't mean to place all of them. I may have placed one of them. Never mind. There we go. But, but, now I don't know if this will work. I've never tried this. Oh, oh wait, hold on. Something else I need to show off that I tried. And it was, I, I just put it mildly on music for some reason. Hold on, where's, oh yeah, magical shields. That was another one. Hold the bus. There we go. The name is the spirit for a second there. Link on. Alright, no. Magical shield. Yeah, I got, I got uh, mana shield as well. Which, I'll need to try that. Mana shield and absorption, I need to get. Because I think that's the thing Xylof want to use is to get tons of hearts. I won't be able to get to the same level as him because he's at level, like, what, 50, 60 something? And I'm at level 20 something. Even with my, like, extra mana, uh, mana gain. I'm uh, not mana. Extra experience gain, I'm not going to reach his level anytime soon. I have no idea how we got to that ridiculous level so quickly. Like, I get he's on the server more, but it's still, like, oh, that's insane. But, right. Yeah, if I use this, now this is actually, it's called Link On. It's the spell you use to get mana link, which has a mana drain and a couple of other stuff. So if I hit a zombie with it though, it creates fog everywhere. It like, it drains, or sorry, it gives me extra mana. It like, drains that away. It's really weird. I don't know why. Yeah, just it creates fog around the zombie for some reason. Anyone know why that happens? Like... It's, it's freaking awesome, but I'm so confused to why it's doing it. Like, what else is on this, actually? Hold on, I need to quickly check and see exactly what's on it, because I'm actually really wondering, like, is this an effect of something else, too? Well, where's Link on? There it is. All right, what you got in you that could create that kind of a thing? Mana Drain and Tangle, that's it. Like, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why it's doing that, but I bloody love it. It looks amazing. All right, uh, next, Mana Battery. Mana battery, which these are broken in this game. Um, they don't actually like, keep their power in, so that's always good. Right, we need essence, or no, we need ventium dust, that, and arcane ash. Good, good. Might as well make a few of these, because I'm probably going to need more of them in the future anyway, so meh. Might as well make a bunch. There we go. Bunch of mana batteries, because these are useful. My God, nice dozen of them. And then the last thing was a mana focus switch. Yeah, there it is. So I need Vinium Dust, Redstone, Overstand one. Okay, that's very easy as well. So let's grab that. Um a redstone one of these chests. No, I don't. Ba -ba -ba. But yeah, so I might not have the magic available to me to actually use some of these silver spells yet, but I'm gonna I'll give it a try making some of them. Like a lot of people want me to use like Firestorm. I'm not gonna use Blizzard. I'm gonna draw a line at making a uh, using Blizzard. And the reason for that being, I just realized something. Hold on. Focus. Grab a bunch of you. I create one with red still. That still has EMC, right? It does. All oh, standard focus is still have EMC. That's so good. Yes. Yeah, any focus, anything that uses just basic Minecraft stuff will technically still have EMC in it. Also, what do the focuses do? Like, there's more to them, but I generally forget. A spell ceiling door. Charge focus. I know some of them for spell recipe, uh, recipes. A bunch of them aren't, though. Player focus. They probably, like, there's a bunch of stuff in Ars Magic I just have never used. Like, I really should try using it at some point, because some of this stuff's, like, probably really useful. Right. Mana batteries in. Got you. Got you. I've got you. All right. I think that's everything, if I'm lucky. I probably forgot something, but whatever. Right. Rune. Um. Venetium Dust. Then a plain focus, which I'm gonna toss in the wrong ones in at some point. Essence, are there any essence in this? I do already. Marvelous. Mana battery. That one invisible thing. Where's that one invisible thing that I had? You're kidding me. <laughs> Oi! It's gone! Oh, for God's sake! I don't know where bloody was to begin with, so let's... Alright. Four of that, plus... Piece of shimmer, right? <laughs> let's make another one. We'll put it in our hands, and we'll not lose it this time. There we go. Essence conduit thing. Got it in my hand. There we go. <laughs> that's such a stupid thing. Uh, mana focus. And that's the last thing. Awesome. Go on, let's... 
Hopefully this awakens my inner magical powers. If I'm lucky. Ah, uh, what do we want to... Sure, that could be an awakening. Why not? <laughs> right. Magical awakening. Okay, it runs out instantly. I need... I need... No, there we go. The hell? I think... Uh, it, it must be because like, the server's lagging a bit. It's like sometimes double-clicking it. I, I don't know. Like, some days it's feeling, some days it's not. Alright, but with this, if I'm right, um, my mana regeneration should be doubled, plus I have double mana. So, yeah, this is the thing I'm pretty sure I saw Richie with. Um, where, yeah, he basically just had the yellow, yeah, the, the, the yellowy goldy mana. Alright, this will be handy. This will let me cast more powerful spells. I never even considered trying this before. That's the first time I've ever tried this. And that's mainly because, why would you think to mana link yourself? That that just doesn't normally happen, does it? So, yeah, I don't know why you'd ever want to turn this off. Maybe if you wanted to link with someone else. But yeah, mana link for me has always just been that spell that I've just... I don't know, I've just thought of, right, I'm going to go in, I'm going to link with someone. And that's it. Like, I, I never really thought, oh, I, I should try linking with myself. Makes sense in a way, because you're linking with yourself, you're linking with your own magic. I don't know, maybe it's just I'm making my magic more efficient. There's, there's definitely lure behind this. Second origin! Oh! Give me, give me second origin. I didn't even think about that. Oh, oh, hold on. We need to rename this. Rename, please. Yes. Blap. Second origin. Second origin. There we go. Is that what it's called? You know, I was getting excited calling it Second Origin. Is that what it's called inside Fairy Tale? Hold on. I need to quickly look up the thing. Alt um, Alt Altier? Altier? Oh, God. I can't even remember her name anymore. I'm so, I'm so bad at this. Um, I need to remember what the thing she did to the Fairy Tale grip after they, like, did the seven-year time skip. We need to get in shape for the Grand Magical Games, but they didn't actually want to, like, make them do super-duper training like they did for Gadgeel and Laxus. They just wanted to, like, give them a free power-up because... Fairy tale logic. Right, one quick sec. We're gonna quickly make sure this is what it's actually called before I sound like an idiot and everyone shouts at me because I know you as well. Okay, one quick Google search later. Yeah, it's called Second Origin. All right, I'm quite happy with that. Also, when I use this, did I get oh, I get experience for it as well. How much? Yeah, a decent amount per. Well, it obviously cuts down after you use it a few times. But yeah, okay, it gives you a decent amount. Doesn't cost anything. That's actually fairly fairly good there. Yeah. All right. Probably need to use that more just for extra experience every now and then, because, yeah, that's... I mean, I know I'm getting a boost as well because of my armor, so that's always good too. But, like, yeah, that's that's fairly efficient, I guess. Right, one spell down. What other spells do we have? Well, we've got buff power. I don't feel like there's any point in me using that yet because I'm not going to be able to use any magic associated with it. Um, Mana shield and... Where is it? Absorption. Hold on, where is it? Yeah, there. Absorption. I don't remember that. Like, a slightly flimsier shoot. I love Ars Magic. It's got such nice things. Uh, like, yeah, just uh, bounces back at you. Don't worry about the weight. It's magic. I'm not going down. Not right now. Just, I, I love the little extra things here. This is a great thing they added to 1.10. So much pools at my disposal. Because you're draining magic from people. It's really... Ugh. I'd love to do something good mana drain. But whatever. We don't need to worry about that now. Right. Uh, like, a slightly flimsier shield. So... What does absorption do? I need to test this. I need to test this for science, magical purposes. Magical science purposes. Right. So let's quickly, we're going to quickly try and make, I'm going to try absorption spell first just to see what it does. And I'll try mana shield after. But yeah, mana shield. I don't know how I feel about trying to make mana shield because I need to make a lot of like, hold on. I've got the book to show this off. Um... Not shapes, components. So if I look up mana shield, it tells you what you need to use for making it. So like, where is it? Mana shield, there we go. We use a mana focus, fair enough. Main robes now, it actually turns out they can be copied. So EMC wise, I can just make a bunch of them. But you need to make battle mage armor. That's that's the bitch right there. And yeah, you can drain your entire magic pill to create a shield on your target, aka your target being yourself. So yeah, that seems pretty cool. What is, uh, hold on, let's look up absorption actually. Absorption can add solar, duration, buff power, and lunar. It can get stronger using solar or lunar? Really? Interesting. 
As a faint light shimmered across his skin, the mage felt his resistance grow for a short while. I imagine that might be what Xylophone is using to get extra hearts, and he's just buff powered it to the max to get tons and tons of hearts. I want to try it just to see how it goes. I'll do a test experiment. I'll oh, wait, what did it say it needed for that? A gold apple, a shield, and a yellow rune. Okay, we can manage that. That's fairly low costing stuff. So let's go for self and absorption. We'll make a very basic one just to test it. So. Uh, I don't even know what to call this. Test. Light shield. Let's go with that. Sure. Why the hell not? I don't know. If anyone can think of a better name for a more powerful version of this. Or would it be a good mix? I, think, I reckon going mana shield um, and absorption of gill is probably the best method. Because mana shield is supposed to be like a shield. That's maybe really good. And absorption gives you extra hearts. Thus it would give make it so you could take hits better. I imagine those two probably swing well together. And, I mean, there is Reflect and there is Shield, but I think Mana Shield is just like the upgraded version of those two, so what's the point of putting those two on uh, when you've got that? Um, then, like, Duration if you want to increase the time. I don't know how much I'd want to increase the time. And Buff Power, obviously, to make it stronger. All right, okay, what do we need for this? We need just the stuff I saw before. What the hell am I thinking? <laughs> right, okay, how do you make a Shield? I've never made a Shield in Minecraft, because... I don't do this version of Minecraft. Um, wood and iron. Oh wait, what am I talking about? I've got shields in here. I've definitely got shields in here. Yeah, because I, I like killed tons and tons of mobs. And like, yeah, of course I've got shields in here. That just makes perfect sense, doesn't it? All right, I need a gold apple. What was the other thing? I'm trying to remember off the top of my head. It's not coming to me. What do we need? A yellow rune. Okay, that's easy enough. Right, so we should have everything for this. So throw in the rune, throw in the om, throw in the vintium dust, throw in the lesser focus, flick the lever, because, yep, still got power in it. Awesome. Actually, I wonder how much power this has still got in it. I wonder. Right, yellow rune, golden apple, a shield that I'll never use, and the parchment. Right. Test light shield. I mean, it said like a light layer goes over you, so I imagine light shield might be like the proper usage for this, but alright. Boom! I got two extra hearts. <laughs> I got the power of a golden apple, and it lasts for roughly 30 seconds. Okay. Okay. That's. How much does two, uh, three buff powers give it though? Uh. Maybe an extra line? <laughs> I don't know. Right, what do I need for buff power? Hold on. Why am I looking in there? That's that's not where I need to be. Right, how much? What, what do I need for buff power? That's a modifier. There we go. Buff power. Um, A lot of valuable little bits and pieces, but all stuff that I can get very easily. Okay. You can put more power into your buff. Each modifier um, added in... Uh, added increases the level of the buff applied. This will not affect duration, obviously, because that's what duration's for. What would be the point in duration if you were going to put it in buff power? Right, harder, better, faster, and my mana pill is now empty. All right, slightly. Let, let's let's quickly try make another absorption one. But will this time, yeah, absorption. Then put buff. We'll put one buff power on. Just to see, one, how much mana it costs, and two, um, what, how many hearts it goes up by. So, yeah, let's give this a try then. So, we've got our, our test uh, flimsy light shield. Then we've got our slightly less flimsy light shield, but still pretty damn flimsy. So, right, I'll be able to just grab all the stuff I need out of the transportation tablet, probably. So, let's just get started. Blank rune. Um, I should really put this stuff in a line. I missed, didn't I? That's not an om. <laughs> Why am I grabbing desert novas? I'm an idiot. All right, vinium dust. Where is it? Lesser focus. Flip the lever. And a yellow rune. Right, now we go into the stuff in here. So we're going to need a golden apple. A shield. This is where the other stuff stuff starts coming in. So hold on, I've got I've got glass bottles. I know that one. Redstone. Why am I not just carrying that stuff on me? Like more and more things are requiring it, but never mind, eh? Redstone. 
And glowstone. Yeah, this is all stuff I definitely should just be carrying on me. And a gas tier. I'm pretty certain I should have one of them, right? I should... Yeah, there we go. Because it's in a few different spells. Uh, spider... I, you know, I don't have one of them. They're all in this chest over here, I'm fairly certain. Yeah, spider eye. There we go. Because I need potions of harming for the damage thing. Yeah, I've got them as well. But... Because, yeah, I need them for potion making. Potion making's right there. Gunpowder! Surprised I don't have any. Alright. Well, I may as well grab a bunch out of this because, let's face it, I'm going to be needing a bunch of it if we're going to put more power onto things. So, yeah. There we go. And emeralds. Yeah, I've got some of them. I've got emeralds in here, but I don't have gunpowder, nether warts, or spite. What the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> but, right. Here we've got our light shield then. So, let's, let's see how this one goes. So, slightly, slightly lighter shield. Then, bah! Four hearts. <laughs> Yeah, okay, this isn't going to take us anywhere quick, is it? It's it's really not. On the plus, it does get me all right experience, though. So that's always nice. Okay, maybe absorption is not as useful. Maybe it's, maybe mana shield is where it's at, then. Huh. I need to try mana shield, don't I? I need, I need to try the magical shield. Um, so in that case, I'm going to need to make vessel mage armor and mage armor. Two hours? No. Armor. There we go. Right, so we need the chest plate, which is brown wool, white uh, runes, leather, and coal. And the battle mage one, which is gold inlay, earth essence, uh, red runes, and obsidian. Okay, most of that's not too bad, actually. Yeah, most of that's not too bad. So, we've got wool. I only have the... Okay, hold on. Do I even have cocoa beans? No, I don't. Okay, this this here is a problem then. Oh crap. Okay, I've got no brown wool then, so that's an issue. Um. Oh dear, oh dear. All right, my new quest now is to get this mana shield. I want to try this. So hold on. Uh, what about color seeds? No, that's not my words. There you go. Put seeds down. Oh, we call dye seeds actually. Hold on. Dice seeds, there we are. Um, yep, here we are, dice seeds. So for dice seeds, we're gonna need a die cluster, which is orange, cyan, ink, and magenta. Okay, I reckon that should be doable, right? Wait, hold on, we can make it using floral stuff. Can we make cocoa beans using floral stuff? No, it doesn't look like it. Use nature essence. Which is made from nature seeds. Which is... So cocoa beans don't even... Okay. So... What can I use you for, actually? Nothing. Okay. Well, so I need nature's essence, then. Not for cocoa beans. I don't I don't need the other one. A chemical... Okay, that's, ju that's just a pain in the ass. Oh, there's no easy way of doing this, is there? Right, I need nature seeds, which is in that basic dust, nature cluster, which is a pumpkin, a cactus, a wheat, and a sugar. Please tell me I have those things. All right, I know I've got cactus, because I need that for green dye, which I need for earlier spells. Please tell me I've got a pumpkin. I've got pumpkin pie. <laughs> Not a pumpkin. Okay, hold on. All right, what was the other thing? Wheat and sugar cane. I imagine, yeah, I've got wheat. I definitely have sugar cane. I keep thinking sugar is spelled E R for some reason. The bubble. Ah, da 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 da. That's this. Nothing's ever easy. I'm always missing something. At pumpkins, I've ma I've passed millions of pumpkins on my travels. Never once to think. Maybe I should pick one of those up. That will come in really handy in the future for Ars Magica. What? Never once have I thought that. I don't know why I never thought that. But yeah, um, so, have I got one in here? Maybe just one? No. Do I have any pumpkin seeds? Even? Just, just the seeds? Got melon seeds? That's not pump. No, there we go. Got pumpkin seeds. Alright, you know what? That'll do. We've got the Harvest Goddess Band. We can speed up the growth of everything in life. So, this is fine. Da, da, da. There we go. So, move, Dragon Skull! Yeah, put it there. Seeds. Then. 
Where's my harvest band? There it is. Grow, you fool! Grow as a pumpkin. Oh, it's not going to be the pumpkin coming any quicker, is it? Oh, come on. Totally should make a pumpkin come quicker. Oh, yeah, just seeds. Now, maybe I also have to go to the nether to get, um, sunstone seeds. That was a pain in the ass. Well, not, it wasn't actually that bad, because technically all I had to do was, um, jump in the nether, get a couple of the, uh, get a couple of sunstone, which with the black hole band plus my pickaxe, I could just get a bunch of them any easily. So, well, it wasn't too bad, but it was still, quite, it was still annoying. It's still annoying. All right. I need a pumpkin so I can get a magical barrier around myself. That is what life has come to. That that is what we that's where we are at now, people. Also, we're moving you lot because you're just in the way nowadays, especially with all this snow. So yeah. Let's just store them away for now. I'll find a better place for them someday. Maybe on the wall somewhere for a display. I still feel really sad to fight this one's here. Oh, that's still sad. Alright, hold on, let's Kinda of, there we go. I'm gonna need one bloody pumpkin. Oh god. Falling in the floor now. Ah! ah, ah. The hell? That was weird. Let's never do that again. Oh yeah, I should probably make. Um, oh, what's it called? I should make. Ender Intervention and Divine Intervention at some point so I can get just back to. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, whatever. God damn it. I, I swear I've seen things with just pumpkins around them. Like somewhere nearby like I've seen pumpkins about please tell me there's like a pumpkin in one of you things just somewhere nearby no so far not hold on. oh 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 hold on your your thingy your Pam's harvest craft you can have pumpkins inside you I am certain of that much please please have pump what if you have a pumpkin please <laughs> please damn it it's a pumpkin I need not none of this food crap Although, if anyone was ever hungry, this is a lot of food. <laughs> Tobacco thingy. I swear pumpkins can be inside you. Am I wrong in that one? It's just Pam's Harvest Craft stuff now in this. I, I swear it used to give us, like, pumpkins and melon stuff in that. Or just at least pumpkins. No? Really? That's disappointing. Could have sworn those pumpkins inside those, but never mind. Oh, god damn. Why do I need a pumpkin for freaking... I, I just want to make a magical barrier to protect myself using all my magic. That was that so much to ask? Seems to be, apparently. Alright. Why am I not checking the rest of my chests, actually? On the off chance I've stored a pumpkin to say one of them accidentally. Because knowing me, I would just do that. Actually, why am I not just checking the guild's chests? That makes sense as well. Like, the, guild's might, the guild might have... Actually, do these bags of pumpkins inside them? I don't even remember. Oh, god damn. How, how have I gone this far into the game? I've not got a pumpkin. That's... You know, sorry, yeah, we're going to the guild. We're going to the freaking guild. We're going to borrow a pumpkin. That's... <laughs> I don't think anyone will practically care, especially since I can just multiply it and then give it one back. So, yeah, let's quickly... Not very often I head to the guild for anything. Actually, I've not been to the guild for a while. I should probably have a check at it. Oh, yeah, and a quick thing. Um, So, I know you just got I said I was going to, like, move out here. I changed my mind on that one. I quite like having my own little space, mainly because I can build my wall. I'm quite happy with my wall. That and, like, it's a little island. Like, sure, I could build a little house here. I might build a little house just to, like, have a house on next to the guild. But I like having, like, all the space. So, yeah, I'm probably going to keep my own space for, um, living in. These are all melons. Do any of you have... Why, why, why have we got farms of melons? G guys, why are we growing tons of melons? Why are we going tons of melons and no pumpkins? Like, we must have pumpkins if, um, others have used this spell. So one of you chests must have pumpkins in them. But yeah. Now, I like having my own little space, like, out of the way and stuff. I like having my wall and stuff. This is very fancy ground. I see Patania's doing very magical things for everyone. Don't know how any of this works, mind you, but whatever. Uh, alright. Da da da. Alright, that's ours magic and stuff, which... So the pumpkin shouldn't be in there. That's bees and random bits, I suppose. Maybe. That's random stuff. That's more uh, ours magicka stuff. Again, no pumpkins. Is the guild not going to get any pumpkins either? Really? <laughs> they really don't either, do they? Oh, God. Is one of them a pumpkin tree by any chance? 
Actually, hold on. Like, I, don't, I know pumpkins don't grow on trees, but this is Minecraft. Come on, people. Because, like, like, we've got all these. These are probably all real trees, aren't they? They all are real trees. <laughs> okay, we're not going to put a pumpkin tree then. God damn it. I wish there was one. I love a pumpkin tree, so I would. Man, the kids right now, I just really need pumpkins. But yeah, okay, let's have a quick look at the board. So, uh, things the guild hall needs. Arts Magicka area, epic hallway, Tinker's construct area. So, just areas in general. Alright, love. Well, I mean, I've not been here in bloody ages. What's going on with this place? We got an ice skating ring in here. Is that what this is? This for ice skating, I doubt it is. But yeah, um, just a quick thing, by the way, for, um... Obviously, I mentioned earlier, there might be some kind of tournament or something happening. Now, I, I don't know exactly what ruling they're going to put in place. Like, they'll obviously, they'll come up with rules and they'll mention it to us all, like, at some point. But, um... Like, for the most part, I would quite like to try and enter it with the armor I've got on right now. My dragon armor. And, like, with all my magic. Oh, look at all the essence they've got. I think, like, 32 of every essence. That just looks dodgy and spawned in at that point. Like, I, I do question these things because I don't know how legit everyone is in the server. <laughs> I don't know how legit. So, like, I work with so many different YouTubers and some of them are just types that will just cheat and there's other ones that will stick to it. Like, me, I don't, like, I try my hardest not to cheat on stuff unless I absolutely, like, need to. Whereas then you get ones like Zoro who doesn't mind cheating and then will lie about cheating whenever they feel like it. And then there's Pat who's not against cheating if it makes his life easier. And yeah. You get all different types. But you know this. You've seen our series enough um, to know this. That has anyone just got a pumpkin at this point? It's all I'm looking for. Like, please. <laughs> Someone please have a pumpkin. Just, just one pumpkin. That's all I need now. Just, I'll spawn in another dozen for you. Come on. Someone have one. <laughs> Nope. All right, we're heading back home then. Return ship. I guess to wait for the bloody seeds then, aren't I? Hold on. Would the watch of flowing time work on this? Hold on. Okay, I'm trying. I'm trying all the magical things here just to get a bloody pumpkin. <laughs> watch of flowing time. Then we'll just put you there and. But, but, grow a pumpkin. The hell? What? What just happened? But yeah, now you grow a pumpkin. Go on. Like you've got all these bits around, you can grow it. Apart from that one. No, it's not for it. All right. Well, never mind. It's good to try it anyway. Boop. Wait a minute. That didn't eat all my magic. No, that one did though. There we go. Yeah, I don't know what it is with breaking uh, dark matter. Actually, like in red matter, it, just, it drains all your magic. It's really weird. But yeah, I I don't know what would be best for using for like a tournament. But like, I'd like to try and go in with the armor I've got just for funsies. Like, I don't know how strong everyone else's armor is gonna be, but this armor is fully rated. And I'll need to get Demon to try battle tests. Like, I'll need to get full battle mage armor. Uh, pimp it out. Get earth armor and stuff. And just try testing spells on them just to see what the difference is. To see what, um, difference, uh, uh, different levels of strength things will be. Right, second origin can stay. Light shields can go, I guess, because they're not... No, no, I need that. Um, yeah, like, it, as cool as it is, which it is pretty cool. Like, that's an extra four hearts. That's all right. Not very many hearts, mind you, but... It's the buff power is just going to add an extra two each time. It's either going to double what's there, or it's just going to add an extra two each time, which means that most would get eight. Which is bloody useless in a fight, because eight hearts isn't... I mean, okay, it's nearly doubling our health effectively, which is still kind of nice, but no, that's that's not nearly enough for what we need. No, no, no. No, what we we'll need... It must be the mana shield is what we need to get, like, maxed out hearts, I suppose. Why aren't you growing? You're really annoying me. It's no pump I'm gonna be so happy when a pumpkin spawns for that. But alright. You know, I think for today I'll end this video here. So thank y'all very much for watching. I'll get the pumpkin and stuff in place. What my I... Oh yeah, I need to I need to make the armor, don't I? That was the problem. Um so I'll get the pumpkin that in place and we'll get this done eventually. Oh god, I'm gonna be so happy when I actually get a pumpkin. <laughs> I could have sworn you can get them out of these things though, like Hold on, just I'll really destroy these ones, just to be sure. Yeah, nothing. I could have sworn they used to drop. Maybe that's the older version did there. Maybe I'm just going crazy. 
Maybe all these things. Who knows, really? But yeah, alright. I'll end this video here. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll get the pumpkin. We'll do the mana shield at a different time. And do other stuff. Demon comes back. Awesome. Got an egg that belongs to someone. They'll, they'll see it's missing and we'll see what they say. And we'll maybe leave a hint that it's here. Maybe tell them to clean this place up while we're at it. And yeah, we'll go, we'll go from there. But yeah, no snitching, please. Because if you snitch, you're just being a bitch, aren't you? Like... Can we, can we make that saying now? We probably shouldn't, like, even though bitch isn't technically, like, a swear word per se, like, it, if you're gonna go down the road of swear words, bitch isn't as bad because it's technically a female dog as well, it has an actual term, same as, like, bastard, bastard has a general term as well, that isn't just for swear purposes, so, and I'm gonna swear I prefer using those words over other ones ten normally, but, yeah, we try not to, no, but don't snatch, it's terrible, don't do it. Alright, anyway, uh, leave a like if you enjoyed the show, if you've got any ideas for different spell combos I should try making, let us know down below if you know any cool secrets as far as Magicka since the update that I don't know about. Let us know if you know any cool spells. Just, yeah, let us know. Comment section down below. On that though, thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you all next time, hopefully, for more Fairy Tale Origins. Goodbye, everybody.